Well, if you're a road warrior, you do a lot of traveling, especially driving by car, a GPS is a pretty useful tool, and they've been coming down quite a bit over the years as far as price and size. I've uh, tried a number of different ones uh, out in the past that you hook up to your notebook computer, but typically those GPS receivers were like the size of a, like a small dinner plate or even like a big hockey puck, which, you know, is not the most easy thing to transport around with you. Well, Microsoft's taken it down a few sizes. You can see this is a, a tiny USB uh, receiver, a GPS receiver that you plug into your notebook computer. It's part of their streets and trips with GPS locator package. So not only does it come with the receiver, it also comes with all the software, the maps to get you where you want to go. Well, and it's actually really easy to use as well. I mean, we all know what a USB key looks like. The GPS device is loaded into the side of that. And all you have to do is simply insert it into your USB port. Make sure I'm going in the right spot there, Mike. And you're almost ready to go. Go up to the tools menu and uh, you got to tell it that the GPS is in there and you want it to start tracking and I think I've already done that here, yep. And at this point, it'll automatically hone in to exactly where I am in North America. And what I like about it is that I can plan my business trips out ahead now and know where I'm going. Typically, I go to Toronto and I have seven or eight meetings and I'm driving around like a madman because Toronto's pretty spread out and I'm going from Mississauga to downtown up to Markham. And in the past, I've got the maps out and I'm trying to figure out where I am. Now, ahead of time, before you even get to Toronto or wherever city you're going to, you can type in all the addresses and when you get there, it'll read out to you exactly where you want to go. And the nice thing is, you don't have to be looking at the screen because it's got the audio. I was going to say that's an important feature so that it's completely, you can operate it on your own. You simply just plug in where you're going and a voice will read out where your turns are supposed to be. Another thing I liked about it, you can actually put in points of interest as well. Basically, the software comes loaded with cities all over the U.S. and Canada. So wherever you are, you can actually go into that and map out whether you want to find a bank machine or even a restaurant. Well, there's over 1.2 million points of interest. And if you've got an internet connection, it'll also update that on a periodic basis through Windows. Live, and that is a cool thing because you know when you're in a city and you're looking for the nearest ATM, you could be driving around for blocks trying to find this. Now you can instantly hone in on the closest one too, and it'll tell you which one's the closest. Well, another thing I liked about the Windows Live, it had an option to be able to download maps and aerial photos that actually plug into this as well. So if you plan that out before you go, it'll show you a picture of the building that you need to find. So once the map gets you close to it, you'll actually have a visual of what it looks like. It's kind of freaky. Yeah. Also great if uh, you know you got the kids going on your summer vacation, you can map out the entire route. You can see how far it is. You can also put in the attractions that you're going to and print it out so the kids can kind of follow along. So a great trip, a uh, great uh, tool for planning the summer vacations or winter vacations for that matter and also a really important business tool especially if you're a road warrior taking your car around and trying to find the next meeting and on time. See if we can find out how to get home. <laughs>